All right. Level four. About halfway on my experience meter. Is that little club thing at the bottom? Maybe they have a. Well, let's see. I guess they're gonna see if I've learned anything. I demand purple and blue on this level. Charm bag, five in a row. Okay. Combine two power ups at the same time. If you happen to get two charm bags in adjacent squares, either top and bottom, left and right, watch this. Take all the gems. Here we go. That one wasn't me. You gave it to me. Anyway, what would I do? I got 14 moves. I need 7 purple, 10 blue, right? Well, I would try to take the bag at the top. And then... And blue. Mm -hmm. They call the puzzle. They call the blue, and the blues are on the side. Yeah. It would be easy to just take all the red out. Greens. If I, can, if I can move it down one in this column here, that'd be good. Greens. Purples are blue, huh? They all just happen to be in a busy spot. That, that would only move one purple over this way, and then random color comes down. It basically moved itself. Probably not ideal, but I have to. I have to, because I have to make the move. Alright, now. Purple and blue. Move that. Ooh. That didn't look good, but I now have another bag, right? And I need purple and blue. So I'm going to take the easy way out. Take all the purple out. I don't know if that actually counted. Maybe it did. Because now I qualify for purple. Now I need seven blue. I can take three out easy right here. Okay. And then I have seven moves. If I could. Need blue. I also need the bag. The three that drops there. So I'm thinking this if I 
Ooh, hey. Oh, the wing key, right? And then the wing key. What does the wing key do? Wait. I'm gonna review my videos when I find out what a wing key does. Cause I have two major power-ups next to each other. I win. I think they were expecting that, though. Anybody who's made it this far in the video, thank you for watching Harry Potter Puzzles and Spells Level 4. See everybody in the next video.